I just want to apologize if y'all can hear my fan because it's hotter than the jalapeno coochie outside. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an updated review on that blonde hair I had that I posted about a month ago. I know I said I was going to... I know I said I was going to update y'all in like a week or two, but I I missed the wig. I missed the hair up. Not, oh wait, I didn't miss the hair up. I missed the wig, okay? So, it was, you know, 12 inches about right here, and I wanted to cut it into a bob, right? I'm not a professional. I don't cut straight. I don't cut in a straight line. I don't know what I'm doing, right? So, this is what the hair look like now. This, this is the wig now, okay? The hair, okay, y'all. Y'all, I want it. I want, okay. I wanted a blunt cut bob that came like maybe um, to my shoulders. Like the hair came here, but I had a 10 inch frontal, I think. So that part I think came about right here. So that's where I wanted to cut all the hair, maybe right here, and make a blunt cut bob. Because I seen one on this girl, I was like, oh my god, it's so cute. Like, I want to try it out. So I had cut it right, and I cut it to the length that I wanted it. But I cut it uneven. Like, one side was longer than the other. Like, I can't tell, but one side was longer than the other. So I was like, okay, I got to shorten this side now. So I shortened it. And then that side got shorter than this side. So I was like, you know what? I really just want some of the hair. Like, I was upset. I just threw the weave. Like, I was upset at myself. Like, I can't believe I did that. I don't know why I didn't ask my daddy for some clippers. I asked my mama to cut it. Or, you know what I'm saying? Like, show me, like, what to do. But I wanted to be stupid and do it myself. So I ruined the wig. I cut it too short. I look like Lord Farquaad when I put the hair on my head. Like, it's, it's, it does not do at all. But, um, um, after, uh, the video I posted, I wore the hair, you know, for a few more weeks, and I ended up going on vacation. I didn't want to wear it, um, when I went swimming, because I didn't want the front of the pop up. But, from, when I posted the video, all the way up to when I went on vacation, which was about, I want to say the 17th or the 18th of July, the hair held up pretty good. Like, it's, the, whatever I said in the first video, it's the same the same feeling the hair doesn't shed y'all don't understand i'm just looking at it. i'm like oh my god i'm so disappointed but yeah the hair didn't shed um it really didn't shed it had tangles but it didn't shed a lot at all only when i once i bleached it and co washed it it had a few strands that's about it the hair was really really soft the hair is really really flowy it's worth it's worth buying I just wanted to come on here and let y'all know, like, if if you want your hair in a bob and you're not professional, don't know what you're doing, please ask somebody because you will ruin some good hair. Like, I don't know, I got a long neck, and so when I put that hair on my head, it's like stopping like right here. Oh, I got a mirror right here, so I'm looking. it's like stopping right here, maybe right here, and I'm not feeling that because I look like I look like stupid like i'm not gonna wear no really really short wig and then on top of that one thing i will say okay i had these flat irons right i bought them from diddy's discount y'all know what diddy's discount is it's like a it's like like an upscale thrift store i want to say that's what i call it i bought some flat irons from there not knowing that that's what diddy's discount was and the flat irons aren't bad they don't get really really hot and that's what I had used to flat iron the hair when I, once I first got it, and it wouldn't get bone straight at all. So I mean, like a few, like the frontal got bone straight, but the bundles didn't want to, you know, act right. So I went to this spot, so I was like, okay, these these flat irons not working. I gotta buy some more flat irons. So I bought the golden hot kind. Let me show you. So this is the kind I bought, right, from the beauty supply store. <laughs> Once I bought them, I asked my coworker, I was like, girl, what kind of fighters you use? And she was like, 
what kind you get? And I was like, Golden Hot. She was like, Golden Hot, really? I mean, first of all, the flatters was $20. I'm not saying they bad flatters. They good for like my hair, which because I have like my hair not really, really thick, but it's not really, really thin. It's like in between, so it's easy to flatter. But for this hair right here, you're going to need some, some con air, some uh, chi iron, some, some for that. Because it, it, it takes a lot to get the hair bone straight. Like, I'm telling you, maybe, maybe it was just me. Maybe it's just my flatters. Maybe I'm not doing something right. But I promise y'all, I went track by track. This is before I cut the hair. I went track by track to make sure that the hair was bone straight. Because I wanted to make sure... You know, I wanted to cut it because if it was to get bone straight, then I was gonna leave it how it was and just make the middle part and cut the side part and this, you know, um, extra side part. But I flat ironed it, did not get bone straight. The frontal did get bone straight, but the bone just would not get bone straight. It got straight like a blowout, um, but it just it wasn't straight to my liking. You know, y'all know that bone straight look where it just flow and it's just like damn like. Bam, dad, that's how I wanted it and it wouldn't get like that. But yeah, um, rest in peace to the blonde wig, you know what I'm saying? It was good while it lasted. Um, but overall, I, I guess I can go ahead and rate the hair. Overall, I'll give it a um I give it a nine. Just because it wouldn't get more straight. But other than that, the hair is amazing. Um I showed y'all my the body wave and the deep wave in the other video. So I'm pretty sure their hair bomb is fucked too. And so yeah, that's all I gotta say, I'm disappointed in myself. Y'all don't cuss me out. Don't call me dumb. I know already. I, I, I'm i there. I, I get it. Okay? Next time I wanna buy, somebody else gotta do it for me. That's just what that is. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Well, how's it got this to me? Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.